Hi, this is Dan Cordopassi of TSG Multimedia, and today I'm reviewing an N-Scale bull hauler from Trainworks. This model that they call a bull hauler consists of a Peterbilt 379 truck and a livestock trailer. The MSRP on these models is $38.95. According to my research, the Peterbilt 379 was first built in 1987, so a truck like this would be appropriate for any year after that. This truck has really amazing detail for N-Scale. I have some HO scale trucks that don't look as nice as this. The paint is very crisp, and actually they've been clever in that the door seams are actually painted on the model or are done with markings. They're not actually embossed or something like that, but it looks really good. There's even little Peterbilt logos on the side of the hood. The model even has seats and a steering wheel inside the cab. The passenger side door even has a little window down toward the foot area. I'm not familiar enough with livestock trailers to know if this model follows a particular prototype. However, it looks pretty convincing and very typical of livestock trailers that I've seen on the highway. The larger holes are see-through. The smaller ones are not, but I think if maybe with like a black wash or something, they would look pretty convincing. The front of the truck looks good too. It even has the Peterbilt logo on the grill. It also has windshield wipers, which are probably molded onto the window, but they look nice. The mud flaps on the back of the truck actually show markings that you can read. The truck has a lot of neat detail. I especially like the photo etched mirrors and antennas. The detail on the wheels is also really nice. You can even see the little lug nuts. The hood opens and there's a detailed engine inside. I don't know if you can see it in the photo, but the radiator fan actually has blades. The trailer includes optional landing gear so that you can park it separately from the truck. The mud flaps on the back of the trailer also have markings, and the trailer also has tail lights. The underside of the truck even has a drive shaft. This is one of the nicest N-scale truck models I've ever seen. I think I said before that it looks better than some of my HO scale trucks. I really wasn't expecting the model to be this good. So not only am I going to give it 10 out of 10 spikes, but I'm going to give it epic model status. If you or your company make a product that you'd like us to review, please drop us a line at reviews at tsgmultimedia.com.